My name is Zaria Jones L. I go by the name Zaria Amani. I'm 16. I started writing poetry when I was 11. Um, the name of my book is Words in My Head. And I, like, took me from last summer to January to finish it. And then it was all about the pixelation of the picture. And then it was all about, you know, making sure everything fit how it was supposed to fit. I mean, how it was supposed to fit. Making sure it, you know, filled up as many pages as I wanted to. And in June, it finally got published. Um, my intention wasn't acting on writing a book. My intention was just doing poetry. It all started out with me having a debate with my grandma. Uh, no, it wasn't a debate, it was a very big argument. And you know, I ended up saying some words that I um, didn't mean to say. And it started out with a Facebook status. And the Facebook status is probably about four very short lines. And from those four very short lines, people were just like, Oh my gosh, that was so deep. And when I went back to look at it, I didn't know what I said. I was just upset. You know what I mean? And it describes people's experiences and it describes, you know, emotions that people just don't know how to express verbally. You know, the heart and the soul. The eyes are the windows to the soul. So when you ask something that you put it on paper, it's something completely different than what you can actually say at that point in time. I became in love with poetry, you know what I mean? I always loved to read it, but I never actually wrote it. So when I started writing it, I kind of, you know, shied away from any, every other writing because if any other writing didn't have any of my emotional attachment to it, I didn't want to write it because it wasn't personalized by me. If at any time you get discouraged about your dreams, not just writing poetry, sit down and meditate. <laughs> think about Think about all the different paths that your life could possibly take, all the different paths that you know you overcame. Think about how many different times that you had fallen, you got right back up. How many different times you felt that you were broken, you know what I mean? But the pieces are fitting back together. 